Okay, so uh, welcome to Over 4 Install Trying. Next episode, um, taking the footage from the last four days and still going to try and progress a bit more. Going through a few various different tricks, uh, trying to increase the speed and dealing with the various problems that come with it. Um, we'll start by watching the footage and then we'll see where we're at. Okay, it's April 16th, just getting a morning session. Just working on my stand up 5 rows. Change the wheels back to the slime balls at this point. It's quite noisy going into the different tricks. Uh, not much speed of them because they're a bit hard to see bouncing on the rough road. Nice little surprise there to get that straight away though in the session. Bit of a mistake there going into a willy grind, but mm. this is game of skate after doing a warm up for a little bit. Fakey pop shove it. Just to uh, add that in. Again, never done that before. Thought I'd try to lean onto the curve as well because I've not done that yet. This is an uh, attempt at doing the trick. I nearly snapped my knee off on the other day. I didn't quite get it, but just a couple of little goes. I was just starting to try and increase my speed, and I was thinking of trying to overcrux. I wanted to get up for quite a while. Quite tricky though, just getting the balance on all the front leg. I just not really done that and my knee itself is really unstable as is my front ankle because I've done them in so many times over the years. Um, this is an inevitable part of what's happened now over this last few weeks. You see the walk up the road, you see that red door open and the lady who lives there come running out asking me to stop skateboarding because <laughs> it was too noisy. So obviously being a good neighbour, I did that. and. Uh, came back at it later on that evening after she finished work because she works in the front of the house. So this is later that same evening. I uh, changed the wheels up to the penny ones again to take some noise right out of it. All you can really hear then is the uh, sound of the curve. So I mean, as I got those wheels on I can now like hit the thing faster, you know what I mean? I'm more comfortable. As you can see there I'm still getting used to it there and taking a few slams. Pretty gnarly because the road's so messed up. As you can see just how many shadows it's casting there. You don't want to fall off. You just shred yourself. Nice little nose slide. So it's given me the opportunity though to come on backside a lot better because I can get the speed a lot more because it's uphill and there's not much on run up. I only really get two good pushes for a backside move. And on the slime balls I can get the speed. Whereas on the pennies I can now go either way on the curb and attack it a lot more effectively. See I'm just like building up more and more, getting more and more speed and more confidence. Again I'm trying to do smiths but it's just I just don't think high enough to get smiths properly. Or I need to change my technique. We'll see. Again I'm starting to get a bigger 5-0 terrace slides. Again that was nearly the whole block I was quite impressed with that but the grids kind of stops me on this one for example. <laughs> and stopped it in the grid, but you know, it was a make, so I was happy with that. Okay, so trying to get the overcrooks again then now. Uh, with the wheel change, going a little bit slower because obviously I'm a bit like, sensitive because I can't really I can't do that trick basically. Keep doing that, it's turning too early, uh, decking out on the bottom of it. You know, every time you do it, you should try to feel the difference and um, apply the changes to get the balance right. So I went on slightly different there, if you notice. I went 50 50 and then put it into this position. And yeah, finally getting the hang of it. And not getting the angle I like. If you watch someone who's really good at it, they tip it much more severely at the front. So at the moment, I'm starting to get them, but it's just a little, oh, a little delicate sort of taste of one. It's not really fully committed. That was the angle, but we didn't see that hole. Again, just get it wrong again and again and again. No. Just a couple of half decent ones. And that was okay. This is the next day, the game of skate on the go. This is a weird trick, like a shifty spot shove it, but you can't put the front wheels down. That took me took about 10 minutes of trying it to get it. To the, just putting the front wheels down in the midsection. I'll get it in a second here. 
pick that up, but it's a really bizarre trade. I had that day off as well because it's a bit stiff, so I just only just skated a little bit in, in the morning. This is the next day, the 18th. Again, I'm going to attack it a lot faster now. A lot more confident because I've had some decent runs. I'm trying to do the pop shove it off. But, but uh, yeah, no easy to split, so that took me quite a while to get that. It's really quite nerve wracking doing it, which is weird because I was just riding it around the street as fast as I can doing pop shove. It's like easy. But off the curve, just a man. A stupid bit of a stumbling block. And then that's when I did it, finally, on this go, I did nothing. Uh, next go, sorry. That one, I just, I don't know. <laughs> Got stuck on the curve. It's starting to go pretty hot now, into the speed instrument. You can hear his lip flying about. nice area of the click clack so the uh, join the curve. So again once I fully warmed up, went back for the overcrooks. I mean once you get these on transition as well, so I'm thinking it's a good sort of like get used to sort of thing. But again, same mistake again and again and again. I just keep getting it just wrong and then falling off in the same way. It's like going back to the day before. So there's one nearly pulled off. That was okay. Take a little bit from that, and then the next go, straight back into uh, pull out the front. But that was quite a nice one, I was quite happy with that. Again, as fast as I can, just getting used to this extra speed, just getting more and more comfortable with that. It's fun as well, it's really good to do that. And I think that was the last trick I did that day. My ankles were just too sore. I know, I went for lunch and then I came out and set this for Game of Skate. Again, I come out and I stiffened up so much, I can barely even reach down and pick up the board. So I just tried this Russian boneless. And everything was hurting me at this point. My knees are sore. I couldn't actually bend my knee because it's just so stiff. That was a hard bit jumping through. That's silly. And there's my biggest critic, my son, telling me it's silly. <laughs> Finally, that, that should be a first go trick. I just have so stiff. I mean, I can do that on rapid on transition. But. So next morning, again, same morning, probably about midday. Started trying to K grinds there. Again, yeah, never done them before. I just find it really hard though, because my injuries in my leg and my knee and my ankle, they now feel like they've been rolled repeatedly because they're just so much shock and jarring when you try and do that on that leg because it's all damaged so badly. I don't know if I'm going to be able to keep on trying those. It, uh, just because I've had things take it. This is uh, the trick to the game escape that was set, didn't they? So if you go to practice in that, Actually, it feels quite nice. You could use that quite easily within uh, your normal sort of run. Quite an easy trick. Just wanted to get it exactly as it was set because, you know, I like to get things properly. Again, I, in a minute, I should ask my son to show, show him what he thinks of it. That's rubbish. That's rubbish. Getting the backside five of those stand ups. Again, not done this well on the curve problem before. Started feeling quite good though, you know. Uh, and then the last, the next few, I sort of like tried to tweak it out a little bit to the opposite side, sort of like would be a solid ground on the uh, front side. I was quite impressed, quite pleased with that. Just getting a couple of them. Like this. Uh, and there's the slam. Snography board for the tail trucks. Probably got a week left in there, I reckon. Something like that. Wheels eaten. All sides. Gotta ride the soft ones there. Gonna buy some more this week. It's really hurt my knee then as well. Just popped it. 
good. I stood my toes into the floor. It's taken me ages to warm up each day now. I feel like my ankles and feet are made of glass and pins, basically. So my shoulder joints really sore. <laughs> and that's about it from the last few days. Uh, been out again today. I'll bring that video in the future. Uh, I'll run over a round for the next few days. Still, still keep trying. Still keep pushing my limits uh, and see what we get to. So if you like, if you want to hear more, hit like and subscribe. Cheers for watching.